In 2024, we witness the culmination of these advancements as we present the top 10 most advanced attack helicopters currently in service. We'll begin with the 10th place holder, or the least advanced on our list, and conclude with the top one. Discover the essential elements that define a modern attack helicopter, including tandem seats, armored crew compartments, potent armaments, and state-of-the-art sensor suites. These helicopters also integrate cutting-edge technologies, such as short-range air defense systems. Number 10. AH-2 Danel Royvok, South Africa. The South African Royvok is based on French Aerospatial SA-330 Puma. As such, the design is highly dependent on French technology and spare parts. With the bold intention of manufacturing one of the best attack helicopters globally, Danel Aviation succeeded in producing an aircraft on par with its rivals. Armed with highly sophisticated indigenous Makopa anti-tank guided missiles, ATGMs, the Royvok outmatches everything South Africa could potentially face in its geopolitical region. The AH-2 Danel Royvok is 40 million US dollars per unit. Number 9. Chang'e Z-10, China. The Chang'e Z-10, also known as the WZ-10, is a Chinese medium attack helicopter developed for the People's Liberation Army Ground Force. It is designed primarily for anti-tank warfare missions but has secondary air-to-air -air combat capability as well. The Z-10 is armed with a 23mm cannon and carries a variety of air-to-ground weapons on four hardpoints, including anti-tank guided missiles, unguided rockets, and laser-guided bombs. It also can carry air-to-air -air missiles for self-defense. The helicopter has a tandem cockpit with the pilot in the front and the weapon system operator in the rear. The Chang'e Z-10 is 17 million US dollars per unit. Number 8. Milmi-24 Hind, Russia. The Milmi-24, also known by its NATO reporting name Hind, is a legendary helicopter gunship, attack helicopter, and low-capacity troop transport originally designed by the Mil Moscow helicopter plant. Introduced in 1972, the Hind remains a prominent helicopter in use by over 58 countries around the world. The Hind's unique design combines a heavily armed and armored helicopter gunship with the capability to transport up to eight troops. While the troop transport feature wasn't widely used, the Mi-24 proved to be one of the most successful attack helicopters ever fielded. The Mil Mi-24 Hind is 36 million US dollars per unit. Number 7. Augusta A129 Mang USTA, Italy. The first ever attack helicopter to be completely designed and produced in Europe, the Augusta A129 Mang USTA is an Italian aircraft ranked amongst the most powerful attack helicopters in the world. It can carry out operations across a wide variety of terrain and weather conditions, whilst also having high maneuverability and significant firepower. First introduced in 1983, the aircraft is becoming increasingly in demand as Turkish aerospace industries work alongside Augusta Westland to produce a variation known as the T-129 ATAK. Infrared night vision capabilities mean operations can be carried out day or night, whilst fitted laser systems make target finding and laser designation a powerful asset. The Augusta A-129 Mang USTA is 22 million US dollars per unit. Number 6. Kamov Ka-52, Russia. Probably the most unique attack helicopter in service today, the Ka-52 is a wildly unconventional design, with tandem side-by-side -side seating, ejection seats, dual contra-rotating main rotors, and no tail blades. It is one of the most maneuverable helicopters of any kind in the world today. With an advanced battlefield management system, the Ka-52 can serve a command and control role for a larger helicopter group of Mi-24s and Mi-28s as a target detector and designator. In addition to its unique characteristics, the Ka-52 employs all the firepower expected from a modern attack helicopter, albeit its autocannon is mounted in a fixed position, lacking the flexibility of a turret. The Cam of Ka-52 is 16 million US dollars per unit. Number 5. Thai T-129 attack. The TAI slash Augusta Westland T-129 ATAK is a twin-engine, tandem seat, multi-role, all-weather attack helicopter based on the Augusta A-129 Mang USTA platform. It was developed by Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, in partnership with Leonardo SPA. The helicopter is designed for armed reconnaissance and attack missions in hot and high environments and rough geography in both day and night conditions. 
the ATAK program was begun to meet the Turkish Armed Forces requirements for an attack and tactical reconnaissance helicopter. The T-129 is the result of the integration of Turkish-developed high-tech avionics, airframe modifications, and weapon systems onto the combat-proven Augusta Westland A-129 airframe, with upgraded engines, transmission, and rotor blades. The TAI T-129 attack is $45 million per unit. Number 4. Eurocopter Tiger, France, and Germany. A joint Franco-German development, the Tiger is the second and the most recent attack helicopter to emerge from Western Europe. With more than 180 units produced, it is the most successful and widespread European design. Employing a composite layout, 80% of the airframe is made of carbon laminates, Kevlar, and honeycomb-shaped structures. Configured with a plethora of Western missiles, rockets, and a French cannon, the Tiger is employed by German, French, Spanish, and Australian forces. However, Germany is planning to retire all the Tiger models between 2031 and 2038. Initially scheduled for the first deliveries in 2029, the Tiger MK3 upgrade was supposed to encompass several significant enhancements. Notably, the upgrade was to include the adoption of a standardized anti-tank missile, along with additional improvements to the communication system. The Eurocopter Tiger is $39 million per unit. Number 3. Bell AH-1Z Viper, United States. The American Viper is a third-generation descendant of the venerable Bell AH-1 Cobra, the predecessor of all modern attack helicopters. The U.S. Marines Corps' asset traces its lineage back to 1965. The latest model in the class-defining design, the Viper proves to be a competent and long-lasting platform. Introduced to the United States Marine Corps in 2010, the Bell AH-1Z Viper is a twin-engine attack helicopter based on the Super Cobra and part of the H-1 upgrade program. Fitted with anti-armor and air-to-air -air missiles, the Viper is designed to carry out operations in extreme environments. The aircraft can provide air-to-ground support but also has the capabilities for aerial reconnaissance. With a combat radius of 131 nanometers, the AH-1Z remains the only attack helicopter to feature fully integrated air-to-air -air missile capabilities. The Bell AH-1Z Viper is $31 million per unit. Number 2. Milmi 28NM Havoc, Russia. The Milmi 28, NATO reporting name, Havoc, is a Soviet all-weather, day-night, military tandem, two-seat anti-armor attack helicopter. It is an attack helicopter with no intended secondary transport capability, better optimized than the Milmi 24 gunship for the role. It carries a single gun in an undernose barbette, plus external loads carried on pylons beneath stub wings. The Russian Milmi 28H Havoc is an all-weather anti-armor attack helicopter, considered a better fit for attack purposes than the Milmi 24 Hind. Introduced in 2009 and notable for its operations in the Syrian Civil War, the Mi 28H can be armed with a variety of weapons, from high explosive incendiaries to armor-piercing discarded sabots. The Milmi 28 Havoc is $16 million per unit. Number 1. Boeing AH-64E Apache Guardian, United States. The U.S. Army's workhorse, the Apache is the most numerous and widespread attack helicopter of the Western world and its allies. As of today, over 2,400 units were built for the U.S. and its partners, with 18 operators as of 2024. The most experienced and proven Western warfighter in its category today, the Apache has seen action in every major American and NATO conflict since its introduction. The AH-64E Apache Guardian is the latest and most advanced variant of the AH-64 Apache Attack Helicopter Series. It is an upgraded version of the earlier AH-64D Apache Longbow variant with upgraded engines, and new composite rotor blades. The holy trinity of trusty offenses, Hellfire missiles, M320 chain gun with 1,200 rounds of 30mm ammunition, and Hydra rockets, a highly reliable and successful platform. The Apache is here to stay at least until 2048. The Boeing AH-64E Apache Guardian is $61 million per unit.